Hello, I'm Dr. John Rosten, COA President, and this is my President's Minute. So I'd like to thank all of you for the privilege of being your COA President this year. It's been a wonderful experience. Uh, it's been a busy time, challenging time, but a, a really enjoyable time, and I, I do say thank you for the privilege. And and especially as we can look around and, and to see all of those people that support uh, the Office of the President for uh, COA, uh, the great staff, the great volunteers. Uh, it's an organization that is uh, very effective, very efficient, and uh, really allows us to move uh, forward. And you know, it's never too late uh, to begin, uh, never too little, never too late. And I would encourage you in whatever way uh, you would like to be involved, whether it would be uh, attending as a House of Delegates uh, uh, attendee or as a uh, member of your local society, stepping up into the leadership as a board member and eventually uh, president-elect president of your local society, or maybe it's a, an eye health affair that uh, would be sponsored by COA, um, or maybe attending one of our uh, ledge days, either at the Capitol in Sacramento or in uh, each of our districts. So uh, whatever way that you would have an interest, even a little, um, uh, can make a huge difference for COA. So in my career, I've been in private practice for a, a number, quite some number of years uh, so far. And, and uh, it's at this point in my, uh, my career that uh, I've been able to provide some of my uh, background experiences as a way to help uh, move, move us forward. So especially for those uh, who are uh, involved in leadership, thank you so much for what you contribute. And uh, it's uh, so important for each one of us as established uh, docs, as established leaders, to really encourage our young ODs to become involved, uh, to serve as a mentor, to personally invite them into positions of leadership and really keep our, our momentum going as we move ahead in these, in these next years. COA is a diverse group of doctors of optometry, and it's really in our diversity that we find a great deal of strength. Uh, diversity in our place of practices, uh, whether we're self-employed in a, a private practice, uh, whether we are employed, uh, whether we work uh, for an organization like Kaiser, uh, those uh, serving our profession as uh, uh, in education at our schools of optometry, we all have a diverse, um, a diverse background in, in terms of our modes of practice, and, and that keeps us strong. We have a lot of issues to, to address that affect each one of us wherever we are. And some of those things involving especially the independence of our clinical judgment are paramount, regardless of where we practice. So uh, we, we can look at that as, a, as our strength. We also have a diversity of uh, individual member doctors, our, our interests, our experiences, um, our family lives, our academic backgrounds, uh, our passions that we have uh, for all of the things that we look at uh, in, our, in our lives. So we have that, uh, we, can, we can harness that diversity of background and, and individual uh, individual uh, interests and passions, and uh, it's through combining all of these into what we do uh, that is a real strength and will be continue to be a real strength in the future. So as I finish my time as uh, your president, uh, I recognize that COA has a great future ahead of us, and there are many great things that will be happening, and I'm looking forward to that. I, I continue to uh, just want to be involved in in our, our association, and I'm, I'm looking forward to that as, as well. So once again, thank you for the privilege, uh, and uh, thank you for joining me in this President's Minute.